Hey guys, what's going on? Sector Polanco here, and we are back with another video on the new what? Kickback. Okay. Uh, one. So today, guys, we're gonna be talking about Kickback, his new bot intro report. I hope he's awesome. I hope. So, guys, let's start. Um, let's start. Bot into report kickback. Add kick about kickback. His faction is a Decepticon. His class is a scout. Intelligent and deceptively persuasive. Kickback's power to manipulate minds is over ever a way to gain access to the information or res resources. He seeks like all the Septicons. What is that? He's saying like all the Septicons. Kickback feels the urge to constantly consume all material around He consume all material around him and is capable of chewing through even the toughest cybertronium. <coughs> Alright, so his stats and abilities. Two star health, 1470, attack 179, max rating 559, three star health. 3608 attack 379 max rating 1294 see 4 star health 9378 attack 984 max rating 3 1515 Awesome. Let's see his basic abilities power leak evade consume. Okay, okay. Critical hits. Sixty percent chance to inflict power leak draining 4.8 to 9.6 percent of an opponent's power over 10 seconds so this is gonna fit a power leak like for 60 second 60 percent kicking attacks have 30 percent critical power rate critical rating Power leaking opponents. Kickbacks mainly hits against power leaking opponents. Have 50% power rate. Okay, kind of cool. Opponent avoids a dash attack. 30 to 38% chance chance to evade a melee attack for two seconds. Heavy attacks. When kickback transforms, he has a hundred percent chance to consume all shock, power drain, power lock, and power rate debuffs on himself, and generate one to five percent of his max power over two seconds for each debuff removed. Let's see. When kickback lands a heavy. He has a 100% chance to consume all power rate and power gains buff buffs from the opponent and generate 1-5% to 5 of max over 2 seconds for each buff removed. 
So that's kind of cool. I hope his Sevy is kind of cool. I bet his Sevy's going to be cool when he comes out. Let's see, signature ability. Teacock Sabotage. Kickbacks attacks can be modified to infect his opponents with T Clock. This cyber virus attacks the bot sensitive electronics that controls their ability to transform. That's kind of cool. Signature ability is Teacock Sabotage. Uh, I love this. Let's see. Heavy attacks. 35 to 70% chance to infect an opponent with T Clock. Lowering the opponent's power rate by 30% for 10 seconds. If the infected bot uses a heavy attack, T Clock is removed and their transformation fails. Stunning them for two seconds. That's kind of cool. Hey, when he does his heavy, he stuns them for two seconds. That's kind of cool. Let's see. Special attack. Special one. Shock in the wound. Kickback uses a shocking blast to turn insult to injury. 100% to inflict shock each power leak on the opponent, dealing 40% of the attack over 5 seconds. Lol. Cool. I can't wait for him to come out. Probably I Night Skies was hoping to be a brawler, but it's a scout. Let's see, special two, lacerate. Those wings aren't just for looks. 100% chance to gain a critical rate buff, increasing critical rating by 30% for eight seconds. Chance, 100% chance each critical hit of kickback swings, blades to inflict power leaks. Draining 4.8 to 9.6 of an opponent's power over 10 seconds. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Special 3, Need Defeat, Hope, Kickback at 8 that first. 100% each critical hit to inflict power leak. Draining 4.8 to 9.6 of an opponent's power over 10 seconds. For each power leak on the opponent's kickback, repairs 3% of his max health over 5 seconds. So when he does a special 3, like a chance of it to hit to inflict power leak. So then at the end of his special 3, then he heals his max health over 5 seconds. That's cool. Synergy bonuses. Mutal allies. Sound wave. Bludgeon. Two to eight percent armor. Mutal. Mutal enemies. Grimlock. Prowl. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So we're back. So we read the first synergy bonuses. Second, mutal enemies, Grimlock, Prowl. Two to eight percent attack. Enforces Motor Master, Ramjet. Debuffs last 20 to 40 percent longer than cannot be purified. Cool. See, I say get him as a three star. I'm gonna put him in my team and I'm gonna synergize with some of them. I have some of them, but some of them I don't have. Let's see. Strong matchups. Shockwave. 
would find this matchup to be illogical as his shock charges he will be will be quickly cons- consumed by this veracious insecticon megatron revenge of the fallen once megatron has been infected with t clock his procability proc liberty i don't know how to spell i don't know how to read well guys to fire of heavy attacks while enraged could leave him stunned and vulnerable weak matchups <clears throat> hound the last night hound's ability to inflict critical rate down with his special attack one will leave kickback unable to inflict power leak with his basic hits sorry guys i've been stopped again so optimus primal primal will completely negate critical hits disabling much of kickback's ability set that resolves around critical hits it's kind of cool Recommended modules for kickback. Scout sentry increasing kickback's critical rate and ability to evade will immediately help him survive while dishing out those potent critical hits. Transwarp cell. Inserting kickback's routinely slams into his opponent. With heavy attacks, will allow him to take great advantage <clears throat> of his consume and signature abilities. That's cool. So, so yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys like Kickback when he comes out May fifteenth. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.